Coach, one of the things that everybody's saying is this team success comes from playing as a team. How do you describe that? Well, you know, we established that very early in training camp. It's, it's been so much fun to watch, and that's why we became such a good team so early on is because they just have been so connected with one another. They really care about each other on and off the court, and uh, they've been selfless, and that's a sign of a championship team. What does it mean to you to be in the finals with this group of women? I'm just really happy for them. Uh, they deserve it. You know, I think a lot of coaches probably feel that way about their team, but this, this group has really been special. Uh, and it's just how, how they go about their business. There hasn't been a day that we've come together that we haven't enjoyed it and we haven't worked hard together. So it means a lot for them to, uh, to put that much into it, for this to be the reward. Uh, it's really special. Do you think that they would say that it would be good to win for you too? Oh, I don't know. I hope not. Uh, you know, you never want them to play for the coach, play for themselves, play for each other. Um, you know, it's just a bonus when the coach is happy. Well, I mean, for me, I was like a little kid uh, because Chuck Foreman for me was somebody that uh, I emulated in my backyard at a very young age playing football. And, um, you know, I, I think for the younger ones, you know, it was kind of a little bit of a history lesson. Uh, for someone like Lindsay, you know, it, it was it was special because obviously she understands, uh, you know, the Vikings history there. And um, I just think to have a, a professional athlete that played at such an elite level kind of come in and talk about what he saw with us and that he was a fan of our team and the reason why he was a fan of our team. Uh, those things were special and it just reinforces everything that we know about us, which is uh, we share the ball well. He talked about, you know, you have so much talent, you know, to be able to blend it together, you got to have people that are, are selfless and, and he had that recognition and he enjoys how hard we play. Talk about your team chemistry a little bit throughout the season. Oh, the chemistry is here and needs to be set on and off the court. They really do get along, but what does that make as far as your playoff run? Oh, there, there's no question that chemistry has pushed us through uh, many, many hurdles uh, throughout the season. And, um, you know, there's no championship team that is able to get as far as they do without chemistry. You know, every, every coach will tell you that the teams that went far had that. And uh, I think with women, it's especially true. And, uh, you know, this group, again, they just, they were hungry, uh, we were healthy. And then that, you know, just the whole idea of how well we play together, you know, that chemistry gets us through tough moments. Talk about a little bit your Uh, that's that's the thing I'm most pleased with, obviously. Um, and again, it started in training camp. It was amazing for me uh, how little time we spent on our defense. And uh, you know, it was basically it was an agreement that we had. If you come in there and you play hard in our defense, I'll move to the offense as quickly as we can, and we'll spend more time on our offense because you know offense takes more talent and, and, and more drill work. And uh, defense is just energy and hustle and, and effort. And um, and this group, right from 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 go from from day one. Uh, they bought into the defense, and uh, it's really been really been fun to see the evolution of the team on that side of the ball. And and uh, we're just so good when we play off of our defense, and I think it's fun for our fans. Yeah, you know, I, yeah, you know, I think um, you know, as I told Rebecca, we were very very happy for her, and, and much deserving. Uh, to be on the first team and you know it's a rebounding that puts her over the hump I think and uh, that's just so critical for our defense but I also think that um, you know our, our team defense was was one of the top two in the league depending on what statistic you go by uh, so I think that uh, Simone certainly deserved the credit uh, so I think she was slighted there but um, I told her I mean, as long as she understands that how much we appreciate it, that's all that matters and I'll take her to dinner or something you know to, to show her that appreciation and um, you know we, we got to continue to be a great defensive team uh, as a group not just one player and uh, that will help us uh, earn a championship.